Back everybody to Foreman Simulator 19 here on Medicine Creek 19. Woohoo! Your host with not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, how y'all doing today? Y'all doing all right? We got the S790. I think that's what it is. Let's zoom in here. Oh, not that far in. The S690. I'm sorry, 690. A beast of a combine. A beast of a combine. Alright, let's, let's see what we've got on the inside here. Nice controls. Don't know what that little round dot with the square is up there. Might be where lights was at or something. But yeah, we got a buddy seat and uh, probably a cooler underneath that. And yeah, folks, it's, it's, it's going to be a wonderful time. Uh, let's go in here first and show y'all. I, I, I made a big mistake. I, I fast forwarded too much time, really, because as you can see, we're already here on 1 and 3, 19 and 18. Uh, canola in these two fields and wheat in these two. And uh, our grass field here is ready to take off. And... Uh, Get up here, field 27. Um, come on, come on, change over. There we go. Besides the lineman, it's got a lot of weeds in it. Yes, things a little slow. Uh, field 27, as you can see, quite of the others are shown that we own. We don't, folks. Let's go in here real quick and, and uh, show y'all some things. Oh, you talking about some. Money we're fixing to get. All right, first of all, I want to just, uh, let me go to this in here. We're at $4,117,820. We do not have a loan. Uh, yeah, we got some kind of stuff going on there. I don't know why all that is. But we're at $4 million, right? Let's, let's, Bill 27 is completed, folks. It's, uh, finalize that I'm just gonna go through these pretty quick y'all can try to pause or whatever but uh yeah you can add up that money right there and, oh man oh my we go whew. so something's gonna happen today one we're gonna try to get through the canola uh, I already have the x9 um, made two dumps I believe um, I just started it to make sure that everything was working. All right. So now I want to make sure. Let's go over here. I don't know what's it's going to. Okay. So it's still not ready for harvest yet. So we'll probably speed up time just a little bit. But I want to make sure we get this field and, and so we can harvest it. But that's all the money there. Uh, they're like all harvesting from here. So let's let's just get out of this and get back to our combines, right? Uh oh, our lights are flashing. I was like, what is that? Oh, I like that. What was that? I don't have no probably on the screen there. I don't know how to read that, but anyway. Um, yeah, a hard worker seems to go a little too far in. We're going to have to get our buggy up here. But this is the same spot, you can judge the distance there. I went from a blue truck over to here. And might made three dumps. I don't know, let's go and check out our combine real quick get it going up oh, wrong way all right here we are on our x9 let me hop out i'm gonna put this back up that way y'all can see we're at four million seven hundred and seventy two thousand four hundred ninety four dollars folks this bad boy is empty 
and I am using the AI helpers uh, we're gonna go around in circles here Get the pipe in. this is the X9 the demo version uh, we don't have the uh, the newest version yet uh, still waiting on Sid modding as you can see right there X9 1000 series uh, when it comes out we are going to get um, oh, Nelly, whoa, whoa, you want a little too fast there. Yeah, I got GPS, so let's take that off. Let's fire this bad boy up. Really don't know which header is the best. This in here seems to be doing pretty good. Um, switch back over to the header. Let's lower that down. We're going to get going just a little bit here. Going to hire a worker. AI is taking over. And here's our XR or 8RX with uh, 44,236. Hang on just a second, folks. Alright, sorry about that. Now, this tractor here, this map is getting kind of laggy, folks. Um, just because all the vehicles in our shop area over there. Um, of course, I only have an i3 computer. Um, this really needs an i5 or more. So let me get up here to this green cart and uh, I'll see you here in a second. Not green cart, combine. Ah, I am the green cart. All right, we made it to the S690, and um, yeah, let's hop on over. By the way, uh, I thought we was going to be getting straw off of this. Uh, I do not have that mod enabled, so I am completely sorry about that. And look how laggy that is. Oh, my. Come on, buddy. Take off. And we did get this uh, Brent auger wagon, which is the uh, 2596. And I, I really, um, I got set to 176,194 liters instead of what they had, because well, it's the, this. Go through that. Uh, capacity was 88,097 liters. I think that right there would be. I, I don't know. Um, the other one was at 70,000, and this one's quite bigger, so. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I know you got a full grain tank. And folks, check out our cotton. On our laggy little trip here. Um, well, I, I'm thinking about the lag and stuff here. I, I do want to uh, think tactical. Uh, I don't hear. Let me pull up my phone. I'm not good with names and stuff like that and I always get them wrong so I took a screenshot of the comment which I'll put it in right here uh, Tack it Ga Gamer appreciate your comment bud he says I just have one question does this game has an end I mean can you retire anytime you want question is or answer is um, yes you can retire anytime you want. Um, if you only want to work your way to say five million dollars, or, or you just want to work your way to two episodes. I thought this tractor went faster than this. Oh, it does go faster. That's what I. But you can retire anytime you want. Um, myself. 
I don't get tired of a game. I, I can play this map like forever. But you do want to make goals, you know, like some some YouTubers make like, well, I'm going to play until I get all the fields bought. Well, if you do that on this, there's, there, there's a lot of fields. How many fields there are? Yeah, we ain't got started on, on a, even a quarter of them yet. So, Tactic Gamer, I appreciate your comment. There's a few other comments, but I forgot to write them down or take pictures, so... Yeah, and a bunch of y'all gonna get on to me for doing this, but the cotton is young, so it shouldn't do too much damage to it. And it seems like time just flies. When I hit that record button, it seems like I can't get very much at all. But the canola, I don't know what the canola prices are going for, and it would auto save. All right, canola. Top price is $36.38 at Laredo Grain. Um, I don't know what this price is going to get up to, but we're going to put it in storage probably and go from there. And I'm still wondering about field 27, which I know I ain't had very much time. Um, oh, it's still green. Okay. Um, this is what we got so far. So, uh, yeah. Um, still got our tractor up there. We got the other tractor like this and what is it? Nine or X or can't really think what it's called. And, but this tractor number two of it. It is the 9620 RX. So I guess we can call it 9 RX. It's just the, the biggest one they made. And crop destruction does look like it was on. So I think I'm going to back out and stick going forward. Yeah, it damaged some of it. Ooh, get out of the tracks here. We're trying to look. The only thing about it having a zoom in and zoom out. Don't look like the trailer done it, it was the tractor, so, yeah. But folks, instead of wasting a lot of time, I'm going to let these guys make a few rounds and bring you back when we're almost done. Um, we still got, I sold that big mower we had. Guy came up wanting to buy it, I'm like, talk to David at the market shop and he was like well that's, that's a good price that's more than we can give for it so I went ahead and sold it to that guy we're going to get a bigger more we're going to get the big M whatever it's called oh I destroyed quite a bit of cotton there but it'll be alright I destroyed quite a bit of canola and I'm getting the cotton in so I guess it pays for itself uh, but not bad we got 15,041 liters in this and um, yeah I'm thinking that this in here would hold at least a truck and a half so we're not really that unrealistic so but yeah let me uh, let them make a round a couple rounds and stuff and uh, be right back with you Alright, canola's doing pretty dang gum good, I gotta say so myself. I just finished filling up this and this, of course this is the first time this has been filled uh, to dump on the truck, so yeah, uh, what was it, uh, from over there to here was like two throughs and then from here down to this way uh, but yeah, all that distance there filled this up. We do have some spots that withered. Um, I wish I could start the, uh, oh, I don't got what it's called. We can do the, the ground checking of the soil samples and stuff. Um, like on Sonoka that I've been doing. 
um, just in case y'all haven't seen that y'all can go check out that we got two episodes up and uh, yeah we uh, done, done two dumps on the other combine there so I'm gonna get this to the whoa with drifting whoa okay that wasn't realistic but yeah well it is oh if you're going downhill so I am kind of going downhill so that's probably why it spun me like that but our X9 is halfway full again oh I'm gonna start doing some course play routes or something for these guys that is uh, keeping up with the auger wagons is bad enough for myself but anyway let me go get this to the truck and uh, see you there. All right, made it here, and as you can see on the side there, everything is full. And I know what I'm lagging, folks. I know why I'm lagging. Look at the lights on the side of the trailer there, in the back of the green. I got the realistic lights on. I'm gonna have to turn that off because this is why I'm making me lag so bad. Oh, me. All right. Starting to load our first truck. All right. We're going to jump over and see if we can catch up to our other combine. Yep. He, he's way down there. All right. All right, I'm gonna try to put this on the back. Equal out the weight here. But see, this combine it don't go that far up into the stuff like the Udden does. And speaking of the Udden, he's sitting right over there. Yep, this guy's almost empty. So, uh, well, let me know down below what you think about it. Um, I know it's going to have lag, so don't roast me on the lag, please. And uh, while I'm at it, don't forget to check out my links down below. Uh, Amazon affiliate. So I got a can crusher, camera light for the... Pretty much for anything. I need to do a video on that. I still haven't done it. But uh, if you use those links, not if you, even if you don't buy the light or the can crusher, you just use those links. Go buy something. It'll help me out a lot. I've got um, about thirty something clicks all together from y'all, and I really appreciate that. Uh, this ain't nobody bought nothing yet. It, it, it don't tell me who buys some but it does tell me like a purchase was made and I got this much off of that purchase and, um, and if you did use that link and y'all purchase something let me know that, that way I'll if you want to you don't have to actually let me know but it would let me know that the system's working but all right this is done i'm gonna go uh get the other combine and yeah we'll be back in a second all right we got the big boy coming around with a full load actually you know what I don't know what I, what, I, ain't, I ain't a full load. More than 34%. Oh well, it's 59,670 liters. That should almost fill this truck here. Oh, maybe that's what I was thinking. I don't know. But yeah, in, in real life around here, the, the guys always start from the front of the truck like this and work towards the back that way this truck here gets full it can take off 
and then the other truck uh, get full and uh, the farm that I worked for last I was driving trucks for they had 14 trucks and we were still short-handed folks on trucks so which way that goes all right I'm moving the spout oh no oh that's why I'm going that way I don't need to move it that way I need to move it the other way uh, that's up and down there we go we're going out to the center now it'll probably be unloaded the time I get there this one here has got like six functions it's got um, I guess it's for it to go that way it's got the up and down on the whole pipe it's got the left and right on the snout and up and down on the snout so I call that a six function so um, we still got a long ways to go and I'm already in 22 minutes so what I'm going to do I'm going to cut right here for a second and then I'm going to do a jump cut to we're almost done and that way uh, y'all get to see what how much canola we actually took off and I'm going to get some more trucks down here too So, anyway, let's do a jump cut, and I'll be right back. All right, folks. Field one and three is done. We've got some on the buggy left back there, the smaller buggy. And uh, me and Mr. Yankees coming up to the trucks here to unload. So, we already got the, uh, the 9RX with the green buggy unloaded and cleaned out because uh, we're going to transfer over to wheat we got field 19 18 and field 27 and uh, whenever it gets ready I haven't checked the uh, the status bar yet on my tablet but uh, we're gonna do that since we get up here gotta slow down don't want to come in too hot or get too close. Now I gotta watch this, but the one thing about it, the combines are clear, no problem. Is the auger wagons with these trucks here. Oh stop 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 stop. Um wrong one. No, nope, that's the wrong one too. Does this not have it? It's supposed to have it. Oh, I gotta be on the header. I mean, on the combine. No, which one? Oh, don't rear me. Don't rear in me. Oh, he's gonna rear me. Oh, oh. Yep, he reared in me. You are fired, worker. You are fired. Oh, no, got a do that okay <sighs> yeah it's hard to find good help it's not mr. Yankee it's just the uh, the driver the uh, AI helper yeah all right folks well I know y'all probably didn't get see much of the combines in action and everything and I'm sorry about that but um, this header here, I have no way of transporting it down the road unless I put it back on that header trailer over there. So that's kind of tricky. Matter of fact, I think I'm just going to sell this back to Dave and um, get us one of those other ones. All right. It's a good header and everything. It blows seeds back on. Uh-oh. I'm trapped. Yeah, yeah, come on now. And I like how it's got the number one there. 
it, I don't know. We, we we might keep it. It's hard to say about me. But anyway, um, let's go ahead and get this and dump. Uh, start engine. Come on. I don't know if this truck will hold it all. Now, all the trucks are 100,000 except for one or two. And then uh, I uh, forgot, you know, to turn the setting down on it. So, but as soon as this combine's empty, yeah, it shouldn't take long. We, oh, gotta get our, uh, this guy. He, he's got quite a bit in it. We'll probably have to, I hate sending a partial truck. It really tickles me pink to have to send like a, a piece of a load somewhere. But hey, for the price it's going, get turned around here. I want to turn too sharp. Well, let's get right here. That auto save gets you every time. All right, now do this. Oh, 4518 at the at the uh, edge grain vault. And yeah, nope, that's sunflowers. We want canola. I was wondering why that price was so good. Uh, 3658. I don't know how good those prices are. I just I, I really like to just sell it straight out. But again, you know, I just. Oh, the lag is real looking at the farm shop. Um, I think I'm just going to wait till the next episode. And have all the trucks down there and everything. Because right now I don't have very many drivers. Uh, as you can see, I just sent Mr. Yankee home. Um, but yeah, we got... I ain't showed you the trucks yet. Um, yeah, we got quite a few. Okay, that is all the way up. That's what I wanted. And we got some grass. This time on the grass, we're going to chaff it, folks. Probably going to take longer. Maybe. I, I don't know which way I'm going to do it quite yet. I'm still thinking about getting the big M and getting the, the small chaffer and just chaff it up into a truck, bring it here and load it into our tanks. Now, like I said, I don't know how much this truck's going to hold. Don't hit the auger on the combine. That's all we need. But as you can get right here, you see it, it just will not go over the back end of the truck. But anyway, let's see here. Yeah, this is one I'm wanting. As you can see, we got one truck here. Let's just jump in each one of these real quick. I, I'm sorry about the lag here, folks. This this maps I'm surprised I haven't crashed yet. This truck has a hundred and ninety five thousand. Okay. Come on. Get on up here to the next one. These should be a hundred thousand each. I just got too much equipment sitting here. That's a hundred thousand. So that's two hundred and ninety five thousand there. That's a hundred thousand, so that's three hundred and ninety five thousand. Three trucks, one, two, three, and ninety-five thousand. It's going back around here. I wish I could got straw off of this. I hope this holds all, but I seriously doubt it. And this truck is full at one hundred thirty. Um, and I gotta get my calculator out real fast. What I say, three hundred and ninety-five thousand. Plus 130,000 equals 525,000 liters right there. And as you can see, our grain cart still got some in it. Wait, did our combine get empty? Eh. 
our combine is empty okay so all we got left to take is the two agro wagons uh, let me just pull this up a tiny bit since that truck is full we won't need it no more oh don't pause now there we go come on oh that auger wagon has uh, 53, 53, 132. No, see, I'm hung on the thing there. We ain't paying attention. All right, let me go ahead and jump over to this other tractor real quick before I unload that. Oh, yeah, this one's empty. So, the total uh, off of one, field one and three comes to 578,132 liters. Whew. Yeah, I'm going to go sell this. <laughs> yeah, that's why I don't know if the price is going up, going down, but I was hoping I'm getting 40 for it, $40. But it's just not going to go that way. But, folks, don't forget about the links. I know I done said it once. But I just want to remind y'all of the links for Amazon. If y'all want to order something off of there, please use my links if you don't mind. You don't have to, but I would really appreciate it. And also, uh, if you're new and you like this, hit that red button. It don't cost a thing. And also, uh, hit that like button. But 36.58, this is going down. Um, we can go to our seasons map here and go to here and then go to canola. If we hold out, What, what would that be? Uh, that's winter, so fall. We got one more day of summer left after today. So if we hold out about six, seven more days, we'll get a little bit more for canola. So I think I'm going to just go dump it in the silo. Yeah. So I hate for this the video to be any longer. So this think that we're going to have 578,132 liters in the silos and then the next episode folks we are going to start on wheat so these take a little bit to unload but it's realistic but usually a big one can unload I don't know about seven minutes I think five minutes depending on how big the auger is and stuff Especially like that one over there, in front of the combine over there, that could unload in probably seven minutes or less. But folks, anyway, I love each and every one of y'all. Y'all are so amazing. Uh, thank you for the comments. I'm sorry I've been slow on the comments. I'm sorry I missed Friday. Uh, just wasn't feeling it, and plus I was helping people get out of the ditches and stuff. And some of them was st stuck at the gas station with the ice. We got at least, at least 10 inches here. I don't know what the weather people say, but the first time we got right at six, and then I think we got four more the second time. It, it just filled all the other tracks back in and stuff, so I'm pretty sure it's 10 inches of snow. Now on the game, in real life, folks, in real life. Um, and Tommy's life, Mr. Blue life here, we're in summer. Late summer, so. <laughs> but anyway, I'm ramming on too much. I just want to say I love each and every one of y'all. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. I can't say it enough, folks. And I'm still trying to push for it at 600 mark. So if you share me, tell your friends about me or something, hey, go sub to this person. You don't have to like his channel, man. Just sub it. I'd appreciate it. It just, it, it puts, uh, what can I say, uh, 
energy into me to where I want to make more videos seeing those numbers climb I know you're not supposed to worry about them which I don't really that's a number right as long as I got y'all watching me I don't care about nothing else God, it takes forever for these unload. I, I need to pull up. But anyway, folks, y'all have a great day, a blessed day. And I'll see you in the next episode where we're going to be doing some wheat harvesting. Hopefully. Later. Hello,